to Bella Curtains. Um, today we're just going to look at a few ranges that seem quite popular and on trend at the moment. We're going to start with some lovely Zappel Velvets. We've got a full colour palette here. This is called Opus Velvet. It's got a lovely sheen um, and you can see that there's quite a range to select from. Um, moving into the next Zappel Velvet, we've got um, some patterns. So we've got a Florentine pattern, we've got a plain, we've also got this lovely diamond right through all the neutral palette and then you've got some more strong colours on this side. Um, one of the trends that never really leaves us is the jacquard. Um, here we've got a lovely Netex collection called Stately um, in beautiful colourways. So we've got just an off-white here with an all-over scroll which is quite large. More of a Florentine with a bit of leaf work. Lovely self-stripe. And this which is sometimes a little bit difficult to um, see as far as detail is a wider stripe. So we've got a very smooth sheen here and then we've got a textured stripe. They're both about the same width and we've got a textured plain. And you can just see that that is a complete story with the five different designs. So it makes it really easy to um, coordinate pieces. We're going to be looking at some patterns in this video. Um, patterns are making a comeback and don't be afraid to include patterns in your decor. This is Flora Nova and it's by Warwick. You've got a really good variety of patterns. We've got some lovely traditional florals, all coordinated with some lovely textured planes. And we've got a variation of base cloth. So we've got some on a linen, and then we've got more on um, poly cotton base cloths. And as we can see from the photography here, don't be afraid also to layer your patterns. There's nothing wrong with putting a multitude of patterns together. I'm just going to look at a more subtle pattern collection from Ashley Wilde now. This has some beautiful embroidery, more of a natural feel, also complemented by a gorgeous velvet with lots of sheen, slight Moroccan feel with this pattern here and then you've got a floral without being too busy lots of background showing and more about foliage rather than big uh, petally flowers some lovely color combinations here we've got the greys with the pinks it's a very tactile feel you've got a bit of a lime in with the grey and you'll be noticing through our videos grey is huge and um, there's lots of ways that you can have you know some colour mixed in with the grey you don't have to have a complete grey palette and here we've got the duck eggs which are always popular Thank you for watching.